All right, with Hudson head coach Scott Mary following the Division Four state title win over New Lothrop uh, for the second straight year. Uh, coach, how do you think you, your team performed this weekend? I know you were the, the one seed, but some, some good competition in Division Four. Yeah, Division Four, it was a tight race. There was a five, six teams that could have won it today. And um, I think I think New Lothrop, honestly, probably had to be the biggest, not necessarily team that like upsets or anything like that, but I take my, my hat off to Jeff Campbell and his squad. I mean, seated six, and they battled and battled. They were battled and all the way to us. And, and then, shoot, right down to like 125, that was one heck of a duel. I mean, it kind of got away from them there at 125, 130, but I mean, shoot, it's tied up back and forth all the way through. So those are really good finals match. Yeah, they took some matches early, uh, some, some toss ups, and then you guys kind of turned the tide in the middle. Um, what, what do you think the turning point was? Was it was it the pin at 130 uh, in the third? Well, I think at 25 we put a freshman out there against one of their kids. He was pretty tough. It was it was a rubber match, and it, and uh, we we pulled that one out six to four in a hard fought battle. And and that kid showed a lot of emotions out there, and I, that kind of sparked some of those older kids. You know, the freshman wins, and we follow him up with a senior at 130, and he was in a it was in a dog fight. It was a three point three point match, and I think we were going to win the match, but we catch him in the cradle and pinned him as seconds are running out, and then uh, that that bleeds into Torres. Torres picks up a major, and then Jordan Hamden picks up a fall. You know, now you're sending Carson Price out at 145 against one of their best kids, Wolford. You know, it's maybe number one and number two in the state, and we win that in overtime. And, you know, you're right. Those, that's momentum. That is one one guy feeding another guy with, with strength and courage and, and heart. One of the things Division IV uh, features more than any other division maybe are some weight changes from where guys are individually. You guys weighed in a little differently this weekend, had guys up, guys down. Um, do you think you, the, the lineup you had was, was the best possible route for you guys to go? I, I can't mention him enough. I have an assistant coach, Justin Butts. He's been with me every single time, every time we've been up here wrestling in these championships. Um, we spend a lot of hours scouting. We do a lot of a lot of looking at track and, and who versus who. And yeah, we weighed in about as best we could. You know, we brought we brought a kid down all the way to 19. Another freshman. We weighed in two good freshmen at 19. We bring Curtis down at 25. You know, we weighed double up at 60. We double up at 45 with Price and Serino. Um, you know, and you got to win the flip. You know, and we happened to win the flip this last time against Jeff Campbell and the New Ultra kids and. I think that helped us a lot. You know, I think he would say the same thing. You know, when you win the flip, it helps. Seventh overall title, and your tenth consecutive finals appearance in D4. What, what, what do you think the keys have been into? Uh, you know, having that long stretch of a decade straight now of, of advancing well, to the championship. Well, because we, I, in Hudson, we really don't talk about winning titles, and that's the truth. We talk about the process. We talk about we build these kids from the time they're four years old, five years old. We're, we're not out trying to get anybody else's kid from next door, you know? The Renzi kids stay where they put. The uh, Pittsburgh kids stay there. Addison's got their kids. The kids aren't transferring back and forth around where we are. You know, we train them to the time they're four all the way to the time they're 18. They believe in the process. They know what I want. I know what I can get out of them. And, you know, when you get them in their homegrown like that, you know, I'm, I'm not saying we never had a kid move in. You know, you're going to have a kid move into your district. But um, Tyler Curtis, I've coached since he was four years old. You know, Jordan Hamden, I've coached him since he's four years old. You know how they think, they know how you think. I think it's, and you, you know, when you're not coming up here to win the tournament, you're coming up here to work hard and bust your butt and let it land where it lands. That's, that's how, how it works at Hudson. I appreciate giving us a couple minutes. Uh, you guys were a lot of fun to watch this weekend, and congrats on another title. JJ, thank you for all the work you do. Uh, Michigan Grappler has never been as good as it's been with, when you've taken over. I appreciate what you do.